My name is Pamela Keel, and I'm a professor here in the Department of Psychology at Florida State University. So I'm here in the clinical psychology program at Florida State University, and my program of research is focused on eating disorders. Over the course of my career, I've looked at factors that contribute to the development of eating disorders, also things that are relevant for the treatment of eating disorders, course and outcome, and also even just at a fundamental level, how do we define what an eating disorder is. So one of the projects I'm working on focuses on purging disorder. Purging disorder is an eating disorder um, that's characterized by individuals who purge after eating normal or small amounts of food. And these individuals aren't underweight. Um, because they're not underweight, they don't have anorexia nervosa. And because they don't have large out of control binge eating episodes, they don't have bulimia nervosa. So what they have is an other eating disorder. One of the reasons that this is important is because we know that as a field we study what we define, that if something isn't named and isn't defined, then nobody even looks at it. And while you could think of purging disorder as being a new eating disorder, it really isn't. So the hope is, is that this research is going to give us a better understanding of what factors contribute to purging disorder so that when people present with this problem, we can help them recover.